There we go. Hey, it's Mike Burnham doing a video news update from the North American International Auto Show, and I'm with Frank Mueller, who is the CEO of Vibra Acoustic. Welcome to the show. Hello, Mike. So let's talk a little bit about Vibra Acoustic and why you're exhibiting here at the North American International Auto Show. I think there are two major reasons. First and foremost, we are an automotive supplier. This is what we do. Uh, we are a leading automotive supplier in, in our field of anti-vibration. And uh, Detroit is one of the key auto shows during the year, which we want to participate. The second biggest reason is, as the automotive industry goes into future mobility, which has a lot to do with lightweight, uh, 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 efficient engines, uh, our products, anti-vibration, plays a major role in allowing those vehicles to bring the performance the customer expects from the OEMs. Okay, well, what specifically did you show here that was new? Um, I think if you look at future mobility, we've got, we've got uh, two elements. We're focusing on, as I mentioned, energy efficient vehicles and reducing CO2. So we're going to show products around that uh, topic, but we're also showing topics around uh, how can future uh, layouts of uh, battery electric vehicles be uh, uh, designed to be uh, uh, ideal for, for the use and for the, uh, the purpose. Okay, and at the show here, what was uh, environmentally focused? Which of your products were environmentally focused? That leads us back to this energy efficiency and uh, uh, just to, to bring to bring one product uh, up, which we have is like a uh, damper isolator, uh, uh, basically connects the crankshaft with the uh, auxiliary units. And what you want to have with uh, high efficient engines, you have this kind of start-stop behavior. You've got like cylinder shut off, um, different kind of conditions, which creating a lot of uh, force and vibration onto the auxiliaries. With that kind of connection, you can uh, allow the OEM to reduce the belt, stra uh, the belt uh, tension and you have at the same time a slip included which will not immediately uh, bring all the force from the restart of a crankshaft into the auxiliaries and that can be achieved with that which in the end also has a substantial CO2 uh, positive uh, improvement uh, to the engine. And uh, autonomous focused or EV focused, what did you bring to the show for that? There we, we, are, we are highlighting our capabilities in, uh, in air springs. Uh, air springs by itself is, is not a really a new uh, product. It's very well known uh, and uh, uh, big growth in the last years for premium vehicles uh, and all uh, big SUVs, premium SUVs. You can see them. They first of all increase the comfort of the rides and the stability uh, in terms of safety as you go through a curvy environment. What does it do for the e-mobility sector? As we go into skateboard uh, level designs where you have a lot of weight in the batteries which you want to protect, but at the same time you need airflow underneath your body to uh, cool the batteries. This system, with, with you can basically control what kind of level the car is going to have over the road, what kind of clearance, and with an uh, uh, um, air spring you can really well control that. And we believe we're bringing technology here with uh, primarily to the sleeve, the rubber, which is a core element of, a, of an uh, air spring. With that technology we have, we can do really thin rubber sleeves, which will create a very good performance in a very compact uh, construction, which allows uh, for weight and, and, uh, and performance at the same time. No, I know Vibro Acoustics is a German-based company, but do you have operations here in the United States? Yes, we, are, we have operations around the world. We've got 43 uh, operations around the world, and uh, we have got eight production locations in the United States. Uh, we've got our headquarter uh, in South Haven, west side of Michigan. We've got another sales engineering office here in Farmington in Detroit. And we've got even a Sandusky, uh, Michigan uh, operation. It's one of the eight operations here in the U.S. All right. Well, that's Frank Mueller, the CEO of Vibra Acoustics, and you're watching Video News Update. Thank you, Mike.